Hey guys, it's Michael Kummer from michaelkummer.com and uh, today I'm going to answer the question on how the health application on iOS handles and prioritizes data from multiple sources. Now what does it mean? Well in my case I have an Apple Watch, I have an iPhone obviously, and I recently bought a Jawbone Up and I was wondering how can I prevent multiple or duplicate data entry uh, with the health application. So let's say if all three devices report the amount of steps that I've taken. Um, I don't want you know three times the amount of steps to show up in health. Now the good news is um, Apple has obviously thought about this and I didn't really think much about it between my Apple Watch and uh, the phone. However when I bought the Chawbone up uh, I was wondering if uh, if health would report uh, you know duplicate entry. Now the good news is it doesn't and I'm going to show you um, why it doesn't and I'm going to show you how you can change the priority of devices. Now by default um, the health application has the following uh, priority. Number one, health data that you inputted manually. Uh, that overrides everything else basically. Number two, data from your iPhone, your iPod Touch uh, and Apple Watch. And between the iPhone and the Apple Watch, the Apple Watch typically wins. So as you can see here on the screen, um, it shows my two devices, the Apple Watch and the iPhone, and then it shows up there on the apps, uh, the job on up application. And then number three, uh, data from other third party apps and Bluetooth devices. And that's uh, where the, the up application would fall into. Now, what you can do is you can go into health data, And then you can go into fitness, for instance, and into steps, if that's uh, what you want to change the priority for. And then under share data, uh, you can see the applications and devices that can read and write steps data to it. Um, and as you can see, there is a, uh, a list and it says Apple Watch, the iPhone, and then deactivated right now is up since I'm not going to be using up to uh, report steps. But what you can do if you were so inclined to, you can go and edit on the upper right and then you can change the order of devices. So if you wanted to say, okay, you know what, instead of my Apple Watch, I want the up to be uh, the priority number one device to report steps taken, then you could move it simply up in the list. And that's pretty much it. And you can have a different priority um, for different health attributes. For instance, um, for steps obviously, for walking and running distance and so on and so forth. And that really allows you to define what is the device that you wanna um, have your data recorded from. And that's pretty much it, fairly simple. Um, there is an Apple knowledge base article as well. I'm gonna post it uh, down in the description if you were so inclined to read uh, more information about this. Um, and I hope you've found this information helpful and uh, have a good rest of the day and stay fit guys.